right, let's. Uh, Rafi and Klee channel trailer. <clears throat> channel trailer. Rafi and Klee channel tra channel tra. Rafi's rambles. Rafi's rambles. Rafi's rambles. <laughs> Hola, you amazing artists. My name is Rafi and I am a full-time artist. I've been doing this with my beautiful wife, Klee, who is also a full-time artist. Klee! Even though you're watching this on YouTube, uh, we don't consider ourselves YouTubers because uh, if we were, we wouldn't be very smart YouTubers. Our videos look like this. Uh, they're not uh, super fancy, artsy-fartsy videos. You're not going to get the typical artist YouTube video stuff, which is like artist mentorship, uh, tutorials, uh, fancy, beautiful images of me painting in the studio. Our schedule is kind of sporadic and all over the place because uh, it's really dictated by what's going on in the art studio. Our topics are all over the place because really they have to do a lot with questions that you guys send into the website or whatever thing popped into my brain that I was like, ooh, I gotta share this with them. Taking pictures of things often makes me feel like, ah! And also, like, the sound in our videos is not, is our videos are just not greatly uh, produced. <laughs> because really, uh, the, the front and foremost thing in our studio is the art that we create. Although I do consider the videos kind of like part of my artistic creation, um, I've never been concerned in making them look a certain way. So yeah, sorry, not sorry. Again, we are full-time artists. We did not get started on YouTube. We got started out there doing the grind. The YouTube videos is more of a passion project because I've wanted to connect with other artists from around the world for a while. Truthfully, I started creating these videos years ago because um, as I was uh, getting started in this art career thing and like really struggling, uh, we struggled with our art career for like the first six or seven years. And I realized that the only thing that could really stop me from pursuing this was uh, my mindset. The fact that if I gave up at any point in time that I wouldn't make it. I didn't want to do like a mentorship, but I did want to put stuff out there that I wanted to hear. The stuff that I needed in order to motivate me to move forward. Don't follow some corporate structure of like, this is how business marketing goes. So yeah, paint stuff and show it to people. Sorry. Recently, one of the YouTubers said, oh, you're not uh, an art mentor, but you could call yourself an art enabler. And I like that. So I am an art enabler. In my experience over the last 10 years, a lot of the, the stuff that a lot of courses offer um, just don't help if emotionally your mindset isn't in the place where you're willing to blaze your own trail and push outside of your comfort zone. So really a lot of the topics that we talk about and the way that we answer our questions has a lot to do with you and your mindset and like where you are and whether or not you're discouraged or whether or not you want to keep moving forward. And basically the general principle behind everything that we do is if you want to be an artist and you want to do that full time, then you got to create art because you're an artist. Uh, you put yourself out there as much as you can uh, within reason and then you persist through the suck. You just keep pushing. Don't give up because the moment that you give up, that's the only time that you can fail. And even failure is just a work in progress. If things are not working out, switch things up, change things up and keep moving forward. And that's pretty much the general answer that I have for just about every question that we get here on YouTube. So like if you don't want to watch our channel, then you could just listen to that and just move on. I think one of the biggest things you notice if you're watching this channel is that I am not a big proponent of telling you what to do because I believe that we're all unique. We're amazing artists that create these unique things and thus our art career should be unique to us as well. So even when it comes down to marketing, the way you sell your art, what art you create, what art you sell, all of that comes down to you. There is no right or wrong answers. There is only the art career that you create. So if you're looking to be spoon fed, this is definitely not the channel for you. Some of the other things that we do online dictated by how much time we have to be able to do it, depending on what's going on in the art studio, is we have a podcast that's out there and that's like on Spotify and iTunes and all that stuff. We also have a Patreon page where we built up a rogue artist community. I've got a book that I put out there called The Rogue Artist's Survival Guide and I have another book 
book that I'm working on now. We also have a section on our website that is for artists that has like resources and like all kinds of stuff, motivational MP3s, just basically anything that I use to motivate me to keep going. This is pretty much what it looks like. We get questions and then we're going to sit down and answer a bunch of questions. Hi. That is why we have the uh, ask us a question on the website. Because if you ask us a question on YouTube, too many. Too many questions. It's it's too many questions. It's YouTube many. Yeah, this is this is website many. Ultimately what I found out was that really the only thing that could stop you in creating a, an art career is you. So my biggest thing that kept me being able to do this as a career was the fact that I was willing to constantly reach outside of my comfort zone and keep pushing and pushing and pushing. So to narrow it down to what this channel is about, it is a random, rambly, hanging out with two artists talking about random and randomly subjects that have to do with the mindset and the heart and the willing to keep going and keep going strong as an artist for yourself, doing it your own way and blazing your own trail in order to make your thing happen. Um, yeah, that's it in a nutshell, I guess. And usually I start it with uh, Ola. Ola, 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 you amazing artist. And then I say, adios.